Hello and welcome back to Invincible Asia. I'm George Clark and today I get to check out the amazing Kenji Fukasaku's incredible samurai reincarnation released on Blu-ray from Eureka Video. Don't forget folks, before we go any further, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel, ring the bell, like the video and all that jibber jabber, and thank you very much for supporting Invincible Asia. Oh my god, I am super excited that one of my all-time favourite Japanese samurai movies has finally got its release here in the UK on Blu-ray thanks to Eureka Video. This is just incredible and one of two classics released the, uh, on June 19th by Eureka, the other one being uh, Revenge, which you do need to check out. It is a fantastic film in itself. Uh, but for me, Samurai Reincarnation is one that I've had in my collection for a long time. On videotape, which, oh my god, I mean, I just loved watching this. Uh, and I'm really hoping that what's on that Blu-ray is a lot longer, is the uncut version, because this, I think, is like, yeah, 90 minutes on here. But this VTC videotape as you can see here is probably as old as I am if I'm being <laughs> if I'm being honest let me see what year did this come out 1981 okay so maybe not as old all right but this would have been an early 80s uh, to mid 80s video release this is an original X rental distributed by VTC and this movie just blew me away when I first saw it. I think I was probably around uh, 14, 15 years of age and I, had, I don't think I'd ever seen anything quite like it to be honest. Inside there, the tape's not bad, it's not moulded uh, as yet here but I did love the VTC releases, I've got quite a few of them there um, and I always had a soft spot for this movie. Uh, the wonderful Sunny Shiba, uh, Hiroyuki, Juxanada in there, Ken Sawada, uh, who else have we got? Oh my god, Ken Otaka, Ken Sawa, Sawada. Um, I mean, this for me is one of the most exciting releases of the year so far, uh, on a personal level for sure. Uh, directed by the wonderful Kenji Fukasaku, of course, who I suppose is more known for Battle Royale, uh, although has done endless amounts of incredible films there but yes this is just fantastic uh 2k restoration part of their masters of cinema number 277 i think revenge was 278 i should have done them in order that would have made more sense anyway let's get stuck in because i cannot friggin wait this is definitely going to be tonight's uh, viewing pleasure for me wow absolutely gorgeous look at that artwork beautiful and it looks very japanese in its style it's gotta be uh wait, wait, wait. Uh, artwork by takato yamamoto uh yamamato sorry but look at that is that not friggin beautiful i hope there's a poster of that in here uh just gorgeous absolutely gorgeous I mean, if you have not seen Samurai Reincarnation, you need to get your hands on this movie. It's just fucking, it's so mental. It's just crazy, but it is amazing. And that's just from uh, a 4.3 pan and scan video release. This is a 2K restoration. Hopefully, ah, uh, yes, 122 minutes length. Okay, so, <laughs> so jumping from that 90 minute video to uh, an HD version in 122 minutes is clearly exciting me. Okay, what have we got in here? We have got a limited edition slipcase featuring artwork by Takato Yamamoto. A 1080p presentation on Blu-ray from a 2K restoration of the original film Elements, which is just beautiful. Uncompressed original Japanese mono audio. Alternate English dubbed audio, which is great. That's what's on the video. Uh, it might be nice to go back to that and see it for the whole feature. Optional English subtitles, brand new audio commentary by Tom Mez, Samurai Fictions, a brand new appreciation by filmmaker Kenta Fukasaku, uh, Kenji's son, who went on to direct Battle Royale 2, of course, 
uh, original Japanese trailer plus a collector's booklet featuring a new essay by Jonathan Clements. Absolutely wonderful, cannot wait. Rated 18 for a reason. Look at that, something different for a change. Okay, let's pop that slip down. Oh, this is just crazy. Okay, I need to I need to get into this and pop it out because I, I don't think I can wait much longer. I really, <laughs> really need to go and see Sunny Shiva in action as Jubei the ninja. Oh my God. Okay, look at this. Inside we got the desk, we got this gorgeous booklet here. <laughs> <laughs> so that was the other way around there and I'm gonna slip out this cover uh, Again, I think this is uh, limited to about 2,000 prints in its first run uh, After that you don't get your booklet. You don't get your slip cover So get out there and get this quick if you are a fan of Sunny Shiba uh, Hiroyuki Sanada classic Japanese uh, cinema uh, or of the director of the genre of the fantasy elements this is one that you definitely definitely have to pick up I mean I don't even need to watch this to know how good it's going to be but I'm going to watch it because that's without a doubt Jesus uh, yes a nice shot in there but oh my god super 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 excited you know the video always I always enjoyed it and it always did me good but to be able to see this in full HD uh, and uncut is just phenomenal. Here we have Sunny Shiva on the front, the late Sunny Shiva, uh, and then on the back another gorgeous, gorgeous shot there. Oh, I can't wait. I really cannot wait. Look at that. That Oh my god, that is just feckin' amazing. <laughs> you know, to be able to see this in friggin' everything in the shot that the director wanted you to see as i say i enjoyed the video enough to get this excited that this is just going to blow me away absolutely god yeah again beautiful book typical layout uh, for eureka but it's going to make for a damn good read there he is the handsome duke sonata uh who is just wonderful in this as much as i can remember i would say definitely though it's been a good 10 to 15 years since I last watched it. Uh, so this is going to be some screening. Beautiful. Okay, cannot wait to get stuck into that and read it. Uh, that's all I have to show you here. I cannot wait to go in now and watch this, as I've said a hundred times already. Um, but yes, I'll be right back <laughs> to let you know what I think. So just back after checking out the Blu-ray release of Kenji Fukusaku's amazing Samurai reincarnation and wow to be able to see this movie uncut in 2K restoration is just friggin amazing. I mean I enjoyed the video tape don't get me wrong but this just took it to, an, a, whole, to a whole other level. There was, there was things there that I never noticed before. There was uh, scenery and cinematography that really just leapt off the screen. This is actually quite quite a dark and disturbing movie at times. I mean absolutely brutal here and there but gorgeously made. Uh, very very haunting. Wonderful uh, art design throughout that whole film and you can see the connections between the violence of Battle Royale and this. I mean it's totally there and it absolutely is what Kenji is fantastic at or was fantastic at I should say sorry. Uh, but yes amazing print by all means. I've yet to go back and check out the full film with the audio commentary from Tom Mez. I did listen to some of the English dub just to take me back a bit um, to that videotape and it was great to hear I have to say but I did want to experience this in its original Japanese language for the first time with English subtitles and it was something else. I have to say it was a fantastic screening. Uh, the special features there we have Samurai Fictions um, with Kenji's son, Kenta Fukusaku, of course the director of Battle Royale 2, the writer of uh, Battle Royale 1 and 2. Um, very, very fantastically put together interview with him. Uh, you can feel that just that passion and that love for his father when he's talking about it. It runs for almost 28 minutes, um, put together by Tom Mez. And very, very interesting, very good. He, showed, he shares with you his stories about his father, uh, about the stories behind this, of course. Some sketches that his uh, father had put together 
for characters in the movie and a wee bit of history on that. And it was definitely very informative and very, very entertaining. So I'm glad that it's on there, glad, uh, glad that I got to see that. And then of course you have the original theatrical trailer, which is always fun to watch there. Um, but yes, all in all for me, definitely a double thumbs up. As I say, I'm gonna put the link down below where you can uh, pick up your copy of it. Uh, out on June 19th from Eureka Video. But now for me, I am just super glad that this version is in my collection and I can't wait to get back to it again. So thank you once again for watching another video here on Invincible Asia. Don't forget you can check out hundreds of others here on the channel. You can also show your continued support by heading over to my new merch store or by checking out InvincibleAsia.com where you can read my full movie reviews and follow me on Instagram at InvincibleAsia. Until next time though, enjoy your Kung Fu and I will see you soon.